Yo, how's it going everyone? Yours truly here, and today I've got a really sick Mako Shark gameplay for you all. Not 30 plus kills, sadly, but I played super aggressive, as usual. I think these divers may have a hard time trying to get in a kiddie pool without fear of me attacking them, but I'm sure they'll be okay. Anyway, today I'm here to talk a little bit about some random subjects, mostly depth-related stuff, like the starters, I just want to throw out there that I'm not making 30 plus kill gameplays to show how good of a shark I am. I'm just making them to give people something fun to watch. I mean, yeah, if I wasn't a good shark, I wouldn't be able to take out 90% of the divers by myself. But I'm not a crown player without a crown, if you know what I mean. Those kind of matches pretty much require me to fight half decent to decent divers and be paired up with an awful shark player. And lately, that's been a rare occurrence because of this game's ridiculously small player count. I'll get onto that in a moment. So yeah, I'm not one of this game's best players. I'm just a sophisticated player that makes good videos on this game. But god dang it, I still want to hit 30 plus kills with this shark. But this game keeps pairing me up with decent shark players when I find decent divers. Why can't I get a grand spanking new shark player when I find those kind of divers? Oh yeah, cause this game's active player base is like 50 people every day. Seriously, why is no one taking interest in this game? It's got sharks! SHARKS! What more could you want? Well actually there's an answer for that. Depth is one of those games that is severely lacking. And even with the two content updates they released, it still wasn't enough to get this game a large player base. Why is that? Why is no one satisfied with new sharks, guns, or maps? Simple. Not enough game modes. I can forgive small amounts of maps and customization, but to play around with what little there is on the same game mode gets boring. Yeah, I know there's Megalodon Hunt, but that mode sucks. Trying to introduce a casual, party-style game mode on a game that focuses mostly on a competitive scale is stupid. You get one guy, that sophisticated as me at this game, or someone better, and we can just end it before it even starts. Plus the fact that the divers have the redundant chore of finding gold to get better weapons and go kill the shark, while the shark is having an all-you-can-eat diver buffet, having the time of his life just makes the mode three times more dumb. This game needs more competitive game types such as blood and gold. That's what I think will grab more interest in people into playing this. But hey, there could be more problems to this, but if you ask me, it's definitely the lack of game types. But damn, that's gotta be tricky coming up with more game types. I mean, Blood and Gold is kinda unique, in my eyes anyway, and to come up with something as unique and fun would be difficult. But hey, I say just start taking popular first-person shooter game types and adding a depth twist to it just so we can get a breath of fresh air in this game. Now I'm not gonna act like lack of game modes is the only problem this game has going for it, in fact I've seen enough stupid things happen to possibly make a BS montage for this game, but it's definitely the reason why the replay value is minimal and why the player count is so little. Anywho, that's all I have to say on depth. I'll probably have more things to say about it later on. But before I end this commentary, I want to cover two random topics real quick. And they are mostly questions you guys are probably going to ask when you're done watching this. First is Ark. Most of you are probably wondering if I'm ever going to do videos on that game. I won't be. I'm not interested. I have reasons why. But that's for a whole nother commentary. But even if I was interested, I won't be buying it as I'm saving up for something bigger. I won't say what it is now, but I will tell you guys in due time. And when I do, it's gonna be awesome. Second is Extinction's first content update. I will not be doing a talk video on that. I'm not gonna give away too much. But let's just say I see how Circle 5 screws things up, and how they're just digging a hole deeper and deeper for themselves. Anywho, I hope you all enjoyed the video. God, I've been having a bad habit of having more gameplay than I do commentary. But if you enjoyed it anyway, be sure to drop a like, leave a comment down below, and I'll see you all next time. Peace.